The world's first humanoid robot boxing championship just went down in China, and these bots fight dirtier than your little brother in Mario Kart. We're talking three-point leg strikes, knockdown penalties, and an underdog bot named AI Strategist, who dominated like it was the Rocky reboot nobody asked for. But that's just round one. Today we've got a military war robot that quit its job to become a nightclub DJ, Dennis Hong's breathtaking robotic ballet art that floats on air, and a machine that solves a Rubik's Cube faster than your eyes can blink. Let's dive in. The future of combat sports arrived on May 25th in Hangzhou, China, where the world's first official humanoid robot boxing tournament electrified audiences. This groundbreaking event, part of China Media Group's World Robot Contest, showcased Unitree Robotics' advanced machines in a stunning display of robotic agility and AI strategy. A far cry from their earlier performances, dancing at the 2025 CCTV Spring Festival Gala just four months prior. The championship followed strict scoring rules. One point for arm strikes, three points for leg attacks, with penalties assessed for knockdowns or failing to recover within eight seconds. Human operators at ringside controlled the action using joysticks and motion sensors, while voice commands allowed for real-time adjustments. A capability Unitry demonstrated on their YouTube channel, showing their G1 robots responding instantly to spoken instructions. In the opening match, AI Strategist, operated by Lu Xin, faced off against Silk Artisan, piloted by Jiao Tianqi. After taking early damage from precise leg kicks, AI Strategist turned the tide with a devastating knee strike in the third round that sent its opponent crashing down. The tournament's dark horse was Energy Guardian, which scored an upset victory over Armored Mulan after capitalizing on a critical misstep. Behind the scenes, these 1.32 meter tall G1 robots represent cutting edge engineering. Their 120 newton meter torque joints enable remarkable full body coordination, as seen in their March demonstration videos, performing side flips and kick ups. The robot's machine learning algorithms allow continuous skill adaptation during combat, making each match a dynamic showcase of AI development. But the event also revealed limitations. When tested against a human boxer, the lightweight robot was easily overpowered. Safety concerns were highlighted when viral footage showed a Unitree H1 robot suddenly attacking engineers during factory testing. The competition has already sparked more ambitious plans. Engine AI will host a large-scale humanoid combat match in Shenzhen this December, aiming to push the boundaries of robotic capabilities even further. From dancing to fighting in just months, China's robot revolution is advancing at a staggering pace, blending entertainment with serious technological progress. Next, Phantom MK-1 was built for military ops, aircraft maintenance, warehouse logistics, even battlefield support. But its public debut, dropping beats at a San Francisco nightclub, Foundation Robotics Lab's humanoid traded tactical gear for a DJ booth, executing a pre-programmed 30-minute set at a tech industry party. Every crossfader slide, every awkward fist pump was rehearsed for weeks, resulting in movements so precise, they looked unnatural next to human spontaneity. Underneath the entertainment demo lies serious hardware. The five feet nine inches, 175 pound robot carries 44 pounds of cargo with processors and sensors packed into its torso. Its military-grade balance systems allow it to navigate rough terrain, but here, it just had to stay upright on stage. The stunt wasn't just for fun, it was a flex. Foundation Robotics plans to deploy 20,000 units by 2027, and showing off Phantom's versatility, however offbeat its dance moves, helps attract investors beyond defense contracts. The bigger story? Robots are rapidly learning to move like elite athletes, Thanks to a breakthrough from Carnegie Mellon University and NVIDIA, the Unitree G1 humanoid robot can now mimic complex human motions like Cristiano Ronaldo's legendary Swee celebration and Kobe Bryant's iconic fadeaway jump. This was made possible by a new AI framework called ASAP, which first trains robots in simulation using real human motion data, then fine-tunes those movements in the real world. The result? 
over 50% less error, and the ability to perform dynamic full-body jumps over 1 meter. Phantom's DJ gig might seem gimmicky, but it's part of a pattern. The line between utilitarian machines and multi-purpose androids is blurring. Whether that ends with robots repairing jets or headlining Coachella remains to be seen. Up next, Purdue University's engineering team has shattered world records with their Pertubix Cube robot, achieving an astonishing solve time of just 103 milliseconds, faster than the human blink, which takes about 200 milliseconds. This remarkable feat represents a 66% improvement over Mitsubishi's previous record of 305 milliseconds, demonstrating the rapid pace of advancement in high-speed robotic manipulation. The record-breaking system combines multiple innovations in both hardware and control algorithms. At its core is a custom-engineered Rubik's Cube designed to withstand the extreme forces generated during ultra-high-speed solving. The robot's actuation system has been optimized for minimal latency, with every mechanical and computational component fine-tuned to eliminate bottlenecks. Undergraduate team members Junpei Oda, Aden Hurd, Matthew Patrohe, and Alex Berta develop solutions to numerous technical challenges, including preventing cube deformation at high speeds and minimizing sensor feedback delays. Their achievement becomes even more impressive when contrasted with human capabilities. The current human world record stands at 3.05 seconds, held by seven-year-old Chinese cuber Xuanyi Gang. This demonstration of extreme speed manipulation has implications beyond puzzle solving, potentially informing advancements in manufacturing automation, logistics sorting systems, and other applications requiring millisecond precision robotic movements. Moving on, South Korea's Rainbow Robotics is poised to revolutionize humanoid interaction with its RBY-1 platform, showcased its cutting-edge control systems at IEEICRA 2025 in Atlanta. The showcase featured an impressive suite of interfaces, a precision master arm for delicate manipulation, an intuitive touchpad joystick hybrid, and an immersive VR control platform, all complemented by a proprietary Mechanum wheel system for omnidirectional mobility and a robust SDK for developer integration. This technological leap comes with strong backing from Samsung Electronics, which increased its stake to 35% in January 2025, signaling serious commitment to robotics innovation. The RBY-1 itself represents a novel approach to humanoid design, merging a wheeled mobile base with an advanced bimanual upper body. Its seven degree of freedom arms and six axis torso provide exceptional dexterity, while the dynamic height adjustment system spanning over 50 centimeters enables versatile operation across different workspaces. Interestingly, the ICRA event also featured a fascinating fusion of robotics and art through Dennis Hong's buoyant choreographies installation. This ethereal performance piece redefines robotic movement with helium-based bipedal dancers that float through synchronized routines of light and sound. More than mere spectacle, the installation represents a philosophical exploration of human-machine harmony, where articulated mechanisms achieve weightless organic motion to create a truly multi-sensory dialogue between technology and artistic expression. The U.S. Army is taking chemical defense to unprecedented levels with its $1.7 million Porton Man robotic test system, a sophisticated humanoid platform designed to revolutionize protective gear evaluation. This sensor-laden marvel, adapted from the UK's original design, represents a quantum leap from traditional testing methods that examined individual suit components in isolation. Porton Man's true innovation lies in its comprehensive sensor array, over 100 precision instruments distributed throughout its anthropomorphic frame, that provides real-time data on chemical penetration and suit integrity during full-body motion. The system replicates an astonishing range of soldier movements with battlefield authenticity, marching at one meter per second, running up to three meters per second, kneeling, weapon aiming, and even stair climbing. This dynamic testing capability allows for the first truly realistic assessment of how protective ensembles perform during actual combat maneuvers. Scheduled for delivery within 18 to 24 months, the US version will undergo final validation at Dugway Proving Grounds upgraded multiple chemical agent chamber. The Army has already planned for a second unit 
to enable comparative testing of next-generation gear against current standards. What's valuable about Portman is its ability to conduct whole ensemble testing under varied environmental conditions, a critical advancement for protecting warfighters against modern chemical threats. Last but not least, LIMX Dynamics Tron 1 represents a fresh approach to humanoid robotics research, combining accessible pricing with Star Wars-inspired design. This bipedal platform, reminiscent of the iconic ATST Walker, recently earned the prestigious 2025 RBR50 Robotics Innovation Award for its novel approach to mobile manipulation research. The newly introduced modular arm transforms Tron 1 from a simple mobility platform into a complete research solution for studying whole body control. The complex interplay of balance, locomotion, and manipulation that remains one of robotics' greatest challenges. Researchers can outfit the platform with various sensor suites, including an optional LiDAR and depth camera package that provides out-of-the-box 3D mapping and navigation capabilities. Tron 1 supports multiple expansion configurations, including an NVIDIA NX computing module for advanced AI development and a high-performance pickup module enabling voice control and interaction studies. At its core, Tron 1 addresses a critical need in robotics research, an affordable, ready-to-use platform that allows labs to focus on algorithm development rather than hardware troubleshooting. The system's bionic design incorporates lessons from both legged and wheeled robotics, offering stability for manipulation tasks while maintaining mobility. So, which bot gets your vote? From AI strategists' boxing moves to Phantom MK1's DJ skills, Purdue's Lightning Cube Solver to Rainbow's Precision Control, robots are crushing it everywhere. Tron 1 walks the science fiction talk, Horton Man tests deadly gear, while floating bot ballerinas dance into art history. Drop your favorite in the comments and subscribe to stay ahead of the robot takeover. See ya.